Oh my god. Oh, the memories. Oh, Subnautica. Where have you been? Welcome back, everybody. It's been a long time. I know we're in the middle of a playthrough of Below Zero, which is the follow up to this game. So what, what are we doing here? I'm, I'm going to tell you. There's been a reveal, a massive, a huge reveal. Some would even say it's gargantuan. We all know that the frozen Leviathan in Below Zero and the Sea Emperor in the original Subnautica, those are like the biggest Leviathans ever, right? Those, at least as far as being alive or being able to see in the flesh, even though it's frozen, those take the titles. We are aware that there are skeletal remains, carcasses that could take the title of biggest Leviathan ever, especially in the Lost River of Gargantuan Leviathan, the skull with the rib cage that's supposed to be like a mile long and we're only seeing like a third of it, you know? That thing used to be alive. That was real. That would take the title. Now, we also also know that Subnautica can be modded, which is something that has piqued my interest lately. Uh, let me know down below if you would like to see a modded playthrough with all different kinds of sh Trust me, there's, there's everything. Anyway, there's this mod team called Space Cat Creations, consisting of Ultraviolet Mango and Lee23. They have created a mod called a Gargantuan Return, which as you may have guessed or may have already known because other people have covered this already, adds the Gargantuan Leviathan to the game. It's fully alive, fully breathing, fully terrifying. And we're going to be experiencing that together today. In addition, to a gargantuan return. Space Cat Creations is also working on a mod called De Extinction. Now, De Extinction brings in a whole school of creatures. There's some terrifying beasts that are derived from concept art you may have seen floating around here and there over the past few years, whether they are official concept art or not. They are also fully animated, breathing, living, and terrifying. Some are cute. So we're gonna take a look at that as well. Now keep in mind, these mods currently, as of the recording and publishing of this video, are not public. Space Cat Creations were kind enough to provide me these mods to show off to you guys while they're still being developed. Now, because they are still being developed, keep in mind that this is not the final look of all the creatures. I'm sure a lot of things are gonna get updated and tweaked, and of course, more content. If you want more information, there are links down below. You can check out the trailer that was made for Gargantuan Return, and some development videos as well. Also, you can check out the guy who actually sculpted the model for the Gargantuan Leviathan. Dran DM. That link will be down below as well. If you're into that, I know there's a lot of people that are really into these Subnautica mods and I kind of passed it up for the longest time, but I'm telling you, man, some of the stuff I've seen on there, it'd be really fun to put together a huge mod compilation and try and survive and play through the game. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. I know that was a long talk. Let's get into the mods. Oh, hey, it's our first one of the day. What are you, Grand Glider? What I really think is cool, but look at this. They got custom, like the, the, the data bank entries. Look at this, it's so cool. Grand Glider, a medium-sized herbivore with an unusual ocular arrangement. This animal often forms large schools uh, within the water column for safety, though this may have the unintended effect of attracting the attention of larger predators. Wait, it's edible? How does that work? Do you die or what? Oh. It was dead. Back up. Yeah, I don't think I can eat it properly. Maybe that's not in the game yet. Whoa. Local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Oh, great. The Aurora's going to blow up on camera again. Whoa. Whoopers. Nope. Oh, here's a big one. Here is a big one. Look at this, dude. Stellar Phalas... Phalas... Wait, what? Stellar thalassation. Thalassation. Is that how you say that? All right, stellar thalassation. Thalassation. A large docile filter feeder nearly reaching Leviathan class sizes. Present suggests areas of more plentiful planktonic life compared to surrounding waters. Large mouth situated at the front of the Lassation's uh, body is used to filter small zooplankton like organisms. Genetic evidence shows distant relation to the paper. Okay, I can, yeah, I can see that. You're the right shape. Look at that, what that mouth do though? What that mouth do? That's so cool. Wait, I, I need to see like, how big is this really? Oh, good God. That's terrifying. I'm just gonna keep swimming till I see something new. There are a ton of new creatures, dude. This is awesome. 
Oh. Oh. Here we go. Filtorbs. Okay, these things are like super defensive, right? Dude, these custom screens are so awesome. Small free floating filter feeder with a tough shell. Six appendages used for filter feeding branch off from a soft central chamber. A calcified shell encases the body and can seal shut if necessary. Oh man, we're going deep in here. This is Ghost Leviathan's down here, right? Whoa. What are you? Axe tail? Wait, is that new? That's new, right? That's not an original subnautica creature. I honestly can't tell. I really can't tell. A solitary herbivore with a derived body plan compared to surrounding life forms. Two pairs of eyes protrude from the frontwards dorsal. Wait, no, this is a custom. It is custom. Okay, somebody's gonna have to tell me. I legitimately can't even tell. Oh, it's a different one, right? Yeah, Jasper. What up, Jasper? A large docile filter feeder. Okay, cool. Are they the same? Oh, dude, they even like altered the... Okay. There's a lot of love that went into this. I'm just going to sleep in this dude's mouth. Gotta love the creature design. Whoa! Jelly spinner. Large bell surrounds a lengthy flood for tellum used for propulsion. Uh, edible, but not particularly filling. Still can't eat these. No, anyway, I know I showed images of it, but here it is. This is the gargantuan leviathan surrounded by these guys. And Jasper. Fight that guy! Fight that guy! Fight that guy! That guy! Fight him! Fight him right now! Oh, thank God! Yeah, this is the gargantuan leviathan skull. This is a dead one. The live ones are on the surface. Stop! 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 All of you! All of you right now! I think we have to go somewhere else for these other creatures, especially the big ones. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! What the? F Get me out! Get me out! Get me out! Yo, but stop, bro! Please, please! I'm. There, there are new creatures. I'm trying to. I will smite you. Wait. Wait. What? Why was the crab squid teleporting? Does it do that? No, it was you. I see. Okay. Thank you for helping. All right, we got two new pretty big ass creatures. That one. I'm sure you've seen the concept art for that thing. Oh my God. Okay, how are you? Twisteel? Twisteel. Gotcha. Uh-oh. Stop. Stop. Oh my God. No, 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 I can't die. Can't die. Can't die. Damage 0.1. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Where's my databank entry? Twisteel. A large eel-like predator found within a deep canyon. A long, flexible body allows for a twist steel to snake around the environment with a low profile while hunting for prey. Assessment, avoid. This only relates to other life forms of the planet uh, possessing a quadra. Oh, it's like the stalker. <gasps> Jesus Christ. Okay, this guy though. Dude. Holy shit, how am I gonna scan this? Uh, 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 uh. Go for Leviathan. It is a Leviathan. Okay, you pick it up. You can't catch me though. Ooh. Okay, so it's a go for a Leviathan, but he can't catch me. He's too slow. Stop, stop. <laughs> okay, I'm out. I'm out of this fight. Jesus Christ. Uh, Leviathans, there we go. Go for Leviathan. This vast animal is at the top of the local food chain has been dis uh, designated Leviathan class. Situated uh, within a, the mom the Leviathan uh, are pretty <laughs> for mobile jaws. Mandibles, right? A pair of fins modified to muscular limbs. Consumes anything it can fit into its mouth. Will attempt to crush prey if too large or tough. Hunts. Oh, right, right. Right, right, right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Right, I know it's going to crush, but I'm pretty sure this thing gets eaten by this, right? Come here. Hey, you. Hi. Hello. Attack. Attack. Hello. Oh. Yep. Am I stuck? Am I stuck? Oh. I actually kind of like that emergency sound they usually get on the Cyclops. Isn't that what that is? Hey, buddy, come swallow me. Swallow me whole. Come here. Oh. 
Wait, did he just kill me? It's a one hit swallow. God damn it, I'm back here. Oh, who did you, little guy? Who did you, little guy? Triangle fish, small edible. How come I can't eat them? God damn it. Oh, by the way, when, when I was talking about mods, I'm talking about things like, dude, there's, there's, uh, look at this, look at this, hold on, hold on. There's a map. Look at that. I've been to all these places. It's like super detailed, tells me the coordinates and everything. Oh, and also, uh, this isn't normally in the game, but you can, uh, there's actually a mod to turn off these individually. Those are just two things I found. I was like, hey, I'll put that in for this video, but there's a lot more. There's a, there's a literal boat. I'm telling you, we should, we should definitely consider doing a playthrough of modded, uh, modded Subnautica. That would be a lot of fun, I feel. Also, I might get some people working on other mods, you know, make new creatures and whatnot. Oh, by the way, uh, some of these creatures have eggs. Watch this shit. Hold on, hold on. Aha. So that's the uh, Thalassassian. Look how big that is. Boom. And these can actually grow in your aquarium, I think. Pretty sure. Oh, and the twisty leg. Hold on. There it is. Oh, he's so cute. Oh my God. It's a giant sperm. Oh, I guess that makes sense. But my friends, I think it's time. I think it's time to check out what you've all been waiting for the gargantuan leviathan now first of all we got to make it night we got to make it appropriate right and we got to go to the one place where it spawns where it spawns naturally oh my god so there's a stellar thing nice 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 okay so I, I'm under the assumption that it spawns in the dunes because it wouldn't make sense to spawn anywhere else. If this thing is as big. Detecting multiple Leviathan class life forms in the region. That's a reaper though. That's a reaper. Whatever you're doing is worth it. Yeah. No, I promise you it's totally worth it, dude. Oh, well, there's a reaper, which is already massive. Oh, you know what I can do? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got an idea. I got an idea. Not cool, man. Don't you dare look at it. I think it's chasing its own tail. Okay, very important upgrade for what we're about to do. Oh, dude. Okay, I'm a little scared now. Oh, there's a reaper. There's a reaper. I'm gonna turn off uh, the HUD just for the experience here. Another Reaper, Jesus Christ. Stopped in everything. <gasps> oh my God. There it is, boys. It's like it's it's literally tangled within itself. <laughs> Christ. What what am I even looking? This looks like the fucking dragon from a uh, Dragon Ball Z. Oh. Stop. What's making that sound? Wait, is that you? Is that your sound? Hold on, it's gotta be night. It's gotta be night. Oh wait, let's try day again. Oh my God. How would this thing even survive around here? 
I feel like I feel like predators like this need a lot more space. You know what I mean? There's two. Oh my god, there's two. No wonder it's a mess. Oh there's those beautiful eyes. I'm pretty sure I just witnessed it swallow that entire thing. Hold on. I'm not ready to die, but I need to scan this like right now. Putting damage down to, to one tenth. I mean, this thing would kill me instantly, right? Oh my God. Oh, fun fact. Fun fact. This guy right here is a fucking juvie. This is a juvenile. The head of this one is sculpted on the baby skull, the juvie skull that you also see in the Lost River deeper in the in the caverns. All right, eat me, dog. I'm ready. My body is ready. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Hey, hey, buddy. How am I supposed to scan you? Hi, friends. I don't think he's interested in eating me. I'm probably a nothing meal to him, right? Just a little a little snack. Oh, Jesus Christ. Make a day. Oh, you're still very dark. Okay. Okay, perfect time to, oh my God. Scan. <gasps> scan, scan, scan. Keep scanning. Keep scanning. Oh my God. Yes, did I get it? Juvenile Gargantuan Leviathan. Thought to be extinct as Leviathan class. But... Am, I, am I dead? Oh, I'm moving. Did I get swallowed by him? Ow. Dude, he is ripping me apart. Oh, God. Oh, my God. I can't tell where it begins. This is all part of it, right? Dude, this thing has got to feed constantly. Okay, listen. Size, at a length of nearly 900 meters, the, the gargantuan leviathan is the largest known living creature on planet 4546B, not including the adult. Already seemingly biologically impossible, this specimen appears to not be fully developed. Each body segment contains many bioluminescent orbs that disorient prey as the creature coils around its food. Avoid at all costs. Very, uh, very appropriate. This creature remains stealthy until it has found the target and will go to any extent to put the target into shock. It wields very powerful jaws capable of rendering large creatures insentient with one bite. I think he's still eating my sea moth. Could you not? I'm out. I'm out, Ski. You enjoy your prey, whatever it is that may be. I need to go to the void because I need to show you guys something else. All right, do you guys want to see something even bigger than this? Let's uh, let's bring in the adult. These guys clearly come, right? We know that. This is where the adult is going to spawn, but we're gonna do it ourselves just in case. Did I do it? Oh, I did it! I did it! I did it! Where's its head? Oh, guys, do you even see? Do you even see? That's a full grown adult, oversized. Jesus, get off me, dude. I gotta get to this guy's head. Also with this one, this is the adult one that's gonna spawn in the void. Uh, the beauty of it is that, th oh, he's moving. He's twisting. What the fuck is he doing? This, mo this is the updated model. Oh God, for the thing. Woo! It's supposed to have like scales and stuff on it, I think. Again, it's not full, it's not fully developed. Oh my God, you know what that looks like? Oh, what the fuck is this? Go survive and stop it. Give me the night. Give me the night. I don't know if this guy is gonna actually like attack the ghost of but that would be cool. All right, can I scan this one though? Yes, I can. Oh my God. Come to me, puppy! Oh God, don't kill me. Ow, I lift him almost 2,000 meters. Oh my God, it's the same, it's the same, it's the same. 
Oh, oh! oh shit! Oh my god! Dude, this is un- Uh-uh. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Get me out! Get me out! Yeah, I'm flying, I'm flying, dude, I'm flying. Oh, the ghost of violence got me. Stop it. Hi. Oh. Oh. oh, I think it's over. I think it's over. Did he crush me? He didn't crush me? Oh, I do have damage set to 110. Do you think I could kill this? Hold on. The only way this can happen. Oh. <laughs> Maybe I don't need to kill it. Hold on. What if I, oh my God. This guy is just straight floating up the top. What does this look like without fog? Hold on. Oh, I can't really see. Oh my. <laughs> they should kill each other immediately, right? Yep, there goes a the Seamoth. <gasps> they killed him. They, <laughs> they killed him. It's still moving though. Holy shit. Yeah, I, you know, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think, uh, I don't think uh, me playing this game with these mods is gonna be, like, I'm just gonna die, right? How could I survive encounters with something like this? All right, what about a sea dragon? Hold on. There he is. What's up, buddy? Oh, ho, ho, you are so tiny. You are so tiny. Wait, does he light up when he attacks? Yeah, the lights just went off. What the fuck? See, sometimes I like to think that perhaps it was this guy that destroyed the Aurora. Wow. Wait. Okay, the Aurora is fucking massive. Never mind. Dude, you are just way too big <laughs> to manifest yourself properly here. I mean, you're pretty big. Oh, wait. Dang, that thing is big, dude. Under, I underestimated this one and underappreciated it. Well, listen, listen, I could, I could play around with this forever. I think, however, uh, despite the many hours I've spent in Subnautica fucking around with everything and messing everything up and I, I kind of, calm down. I kind of just want to play, you know? So if you want to see it, I think we could do well with a Subnautica modded series with as many mods as I can put into one into one game. I think that'll be a lot of fun and we can see if we can try to survive, including with this guy in it. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section below. Anyway, this is uh this has been a one-off. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for when these uh these mods go public. I'm sure you're going to just love having them in your game. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.